It's about, I think probably a, the best place to start for this is the place we ordinarily start anyway, which is the three pillars. Because this will enable you to get an even deeper understanding of what we're talking about here with that. So let's begin with the central equilibrium. And that is the ability to find that central pillar, that, that uh, sense of verticality that allows you to connect up to the energy of the earth and, and of the heavens and allows it to circulate through your body um, more efficiently. So to do this, let's, let's begin by feeling the balls of the feet. So when you do that and the knees are unlocked, so you're unlocked and you're feeling the balls of your feet. So just kind of rock forward uh, just a little bit so that so little that people would not notice if you were, if they were watching you, but there you are, you're, you're actually feeling that micro movement there. And when you do that, you are feeling into that, the balls of the feet then it allows the energy to come up through the, the bubbling well points, Yong Chuan in the, in the center of the foot. And then just rock back and just feel into the heel a little more. And then just slightly forward. So you're feeling more in the balls of the feet. Feel your toes pressing down into the floor. Feel that connection with the earth. Allow yourself to sink. Release down and sink into the earth. Feel that like you're at the edge of the uh, at the edge of the beach. You're right there near where the water and the beach meet, and you feel every time a wave comes in, you feel yourself sinking deeper into the sand. You extend your awareness down through the feet and into the earth. And so there's actually just a very gentle rocking that's occurring, so slight that no one would notice. Each time you do that, you can bring your awareness back to that connection. And one of the well, fundamental ideas in Tai Chi is find the stillness in motion, find the motion in stillness. So here we're, we're exploring where stillness and motion meet. And when we look at it, even in stillness, there is motion. And even in motion, there's some stillness. We're just feeling into the earth now, feeling that connection. And opening the bubbling well gates in the feet. And if you feel a need to rock back into the heels, do it very subtly 
but no one would even notice. And then feel back into the balls, feel back into the toes. So we're giving the mind, the brain, a task. And we're shifting from thinking about it to feeling it. And doing that allows us to shift awareness into the present moment. We're engaging a whole brain coherence and allows for us to shift into a super conscious state. And this is not something we cling to. We just move in and out, knowing that we can shift into that superconscious state anytime we want. Feel yourself sinking even more into the earth. Now reach up with the crown of your head. It's like you have an antenna there and it's kind of seeking the, the true north. Reaching up there. And even that, there's micro calibrations. It's uh, kind of like whenever you look uh, with your with your eyes, there's something called a saccade, which is a uh, the eyes shifting back and forth, which establishes depth of field, and it allows you to construct a three dimensional reality with your with your vision. We're kind of doing something like that with our the crown of the head, the knee wand there. We're reaching up and we're searching with that antenna. We're searching for the purest expression of yang chi from the heavens. You can extend upward and kind of feel there's an energy center that's about six inches above your head. So if you can feel that, use that as your as your your locator. It's like a kind of a, a insubstantial lens to look through. So you're reaching up there, and as you do that, you're lengthening your neck and opening the jade pillow gate. As we reach up with that crown of the head, opening the jade pillow gate and standing up through that, we're contacting that young, that pure young chi. And to do that, we're accessing the part of our awareness that is the shen. You know, the, the spirit part of the of the of the system the of the awareness that which is beyond the mind which knows without thinking we're feeling into that yang chi of the heavens, and simultaneously feeling the yin chi of the earth through the feet, allowing that to fill up. And things are apparently still, but there's also motion and stillness. So we're still looking, we're still looking with that, with that antenna. And changing ever so slightly to meet that 
Yang Chi. Feel your body relaxing, emptying out, letting go of tension. First of all, identifying the spots of tension in your body. And give them permission to release. So the, the Jade Pillow Gate allows us to tap into the Jingshan. And Jingshan is made up of two words, a Jing, which is the essence, the body essence. It's the expression of physicality and the Shen, which is spirit. So we're the Jingshan is where the spirit and body integrate. And we, by opening the Jade Pillow Gate, we create an opportunity for that to refine and expand itself. And as you're as you're standing with reaching with the crown, sinking with the feet, just feel your chin, just kind of gently opening and closing the jade pillow gate at the base of the skull. Feel it. So it's not a static thing. There's a conversation that's going on. micro adjustments occurring. This allows your, your spirit to expand and to become more involved with your physicality. Relax your lower back. And so here you drop your sacrum, drop your coccyx, and feel as you do that, not apparently moving at all, but there is some internal motion. As you do that, you're flattening out your lumbar curves up to a small degree. And doing so, you are aligning your pelvis so the pelvic bowl is, is centered and level. And reaching down with your coccyx, reaching up with the crown then lengthens your spine and creates space between there. So we're having some internal motion there too very, very slight, very tiny. But as you relax and release your muscular tension, you're feeling the vertebrae starting to separate ever so slightly, creating space between the joints. It also lengthens the dural tube, which is what contains the cerebral spinal fluid that, that nourishes and supports your brain and your spinal cord. And it makes that, the, that more coherent as well.
Reach with your elbows a little bit. Ever so slight, just enough to release the shoulder joints. We're opening the shoulder joints too. Very small micro movements. And if you find yourself having to shift into your heels, do it very quietly, very subtly. And make contact with the balls again whenever you feel comfortable doing that. You may find that there's tension in your calves if you don't do this a lot. And that's okay. Just rock back a little bit and just feel into the heels. Allow the calves to relax. Point with your index fingers. You can even move them ever so slightly to really establish that energetic coherence. Feel into your hands and notice the energy that's that's building up there. Feel the circulation in your in your fingers. Feel the heat in your feet. Feel yourself pushing away from the earth without even moving, but just feel that kind of the effort to push away. So that you're pushing up toward the ceiling and then ah, settle down and spiral down to the left, spiral down to the right without moving, without physically doing that, but feel yourself engaging the muscles, engaging the connective tissue to do that so that you're releasing your quad, opening the hip joints, allowing the chi to flow through. Feel into wherever you might feel tight or constricted and just gently engage that area and move without moving. Just enough to bring your awareness to that area. Now feel your breath. Notice that you're always moving, even in stillness. Feel your diaphragm pressing down into your abdominal cavity. Feel your lungs expanding as you inhale, releasing as you exhale. Feel the pressure changing in your abdomen as you inhale and exhale. Notice that you're moving even without moving. Feel the pulse of your heart. Feel your heartbeat and feel into your circulatory system and feel the motion that's happening inside.
Now let all that go. And feel yourself embracing the state of pure being. You're shifting your awareness to awareness itself. No story, no narrative, no explanation, just now. begin to re-enter form, feel your feet, feel your knees, feel your hips, feel your shoulders, feel your head, feel your arms. Feel that all that movement that's occurring inside your body. You step in. Take a deep breath. And disappear the chi. Dissolve into the emptiness. Letting go of all that stuff. <laughs> <laughs> 